NASA has big problems trying to open up the capsule with the return sample of asteroid Bennu. So check this out. Looking at an article in Science Alert, it says, oh no, NASA can't seem to get the lid off its priceless asteroid sample. Right? And you remember, you remember when the capsule landed, right? And it was all charred. But then they got lucky because when they opened the initial part of it, inside there was a bunch. If you look down, you see all the dust on the bottom. That was all bonus parts. But the real meat of the sample, like if we go back here, you see these, these aren't even the true sample. This is the stuff that was on the outside of the capsule, like inside, but not inside the main compartment. The problem they're having is the capsule has 35 of these, uh, if you want to call them rivets, these little bolts. They got 33 of them to open, but two of them are giving them a big problem. And what's the real problem is because trying to open this up, they have to open it up in the clean environment only through using the clean gloves. So they're trying to keep the sample as pristine as possible, okay, with minimal contamination, all right? So because these things are jammed, I guess, stuck, now they have to come up with a way like they only have, it's like a little shoebox environment, a tiny little area that they can actually try to open this. But they'll figure out a way. But this is um, one of the latest breaking news on the Bennu return sample. So I'm going to update you guys as soon as we find out what the deal is, as soon as they get into it. But just think about this. All this sample right here, they thought this is how much they would get in total. And this isn't even the capsule open yet. So this is all bonus. However, they want what's inside. Inside, they feel, is the most pristine sample possible. So I'll let you all know what the deal is. All right. For now, that's about it. Just a quick update on that. So... See y'all soon. Take care.